Cancer, welcome to the Onyx Moon Tarot. Like, share, subscribe, comment. Cancer, there is no gender in tarot. I'm using the Heart's Hidden Secrets for your Oracle card message and Circe's Tarot for your tarot card reading. Cancer, this is something that could have happened to you already, could be happening to you now, could happen to you in the future. I am pulling on your sun sign of Cancer. Energy does flip understand that. This is a collective reading. You can check your other placements, energy flips. I could be talking to your cross watcher. Understand this is a collective. So if it doesn't resonate, you can negate the reading. I'm not here to sugarcoat a reading and I'm not here to sugarcoat my titles. If you don't like it, just please keep moving on and you don't have to watch, listen, or look at my title. That's not why I'm here. I'm here to read the cards. Cancer, loyalty, trusting, reliability, believing. What do we got for you? Look at that. How nice. Ten of Cups. Oops, I dropped that. Very nice. Ten of Cups. Beautiful. Let's hope the rest of the reading is like that for you, Cancer. Well, Three of Wands. Okay. Moving forward. Moving forward. Climbing up that mountain because you want to move forward. Keep it pushing. After depression, sleepless nights, insomnia... Okay, why? Well, somebody's carrying a torch for you, or you're carrying a torch for someone. So we have happy home, emotionally, mentally, physically, spiritually fulfilled. Happy home. You don't have to have a partner in order to have those things. You can be fulfilled like that all by yourself. You can be single. But you could also have been with a person. And it looks like you need to move forward. Something must have happened, but you're moving forward. You had some sleepless nights, some depression. There is still some attraction to somebody. Or inspiration. I'm going to say attraction. Possibly still some love because we have the Ten of Cups. Wish fulfillment. You thought they were your wish fulfillment. Did this turn out to be that they were not your wish fulfillment? Chariot. It's all about perseverance, mind, using your using your mind. There's no steering wheel. There's no reins. It's used by mind control. I, I'm determined to move this chariot. I'm determined to move this forward the way I want it to go by my mind. Directing it with my will. So, you're still, in, you're still inspired. You still have attraction. I'm going to say you still love someone. You wouldn't have the type of a reaction like this if there still wasn't caring. King of Cups. That could be you. Or you could be having these feelings for a King of Cups. High Priestess. This is moving in silence. This is being very intuitive, which King of Cups would be very intuitive. They are intuitive, they are compassionate, they are considerate, they are romantic, they have unconditional love. They can be very strategic and crafty as well. Emotional intelligence is very high with them. They can read a room, they can read their partner. Um, but it's all about moving in silence. Maybe you are away from your person due to something and you are strategizing on how to get them back. I don't know. I'm just going on what we have here. Something, something happened. It ended it. Something happened. You have support. You have love and support from your friends and family. Something 
I'm not seeing third party, but something ended this that has put them or you into Queen of Swords reversed. Total bitch on wheels, okay? And it's ended. Loving totally the per one of the happiest cards in the deck. We've got the sun, we've got the ten of cups, we've got the ten of pentacles. So second happiest card in the deck. We were here. That's where we were. Or so you thought. That's what you thought. And I think you came to a realization for some reason that you weren't. I'm going to go a little bit further. Need to make a decision. You think this person is a player. And that they have very little to offer you. This is your perception. I think you still have a great deal of love for this person. Passion and love. I, th I think that you do. You don't have the Nine of Swords if there was no... For as much sorrow as you have is as much love as you had. Because if you don't give a fuck, you don't, you're not going to have... You're not going to you know, insomnia, depression. You're not going to have that. It's going to be, okay, on to the next. It looks like you want to go forward. You want to have this. But you think that they are not a... Now, there's no gender. You could be female, king of cups. This could be a female knight of wands. It could be same sex, whatever. They've turned you into someone that is very sharp. Very, very sharp. Not a loving king of cups. I think it's because you're very hurt. The reality is, your reality is you are a king of, queen of wands. You're... Your, your reality is you are a queen of wands. You're probably very attractive. You have the fiery nature. You're determined, which we can see by the chariot. You persevere. You're a leader. You know what you want. You have pride. I'm not going to say egotistical, but you do have pride. And if someone was playing you... You are embodying the spirit of the Queen of Wands. Queen of Wands is a tough cookie. Queen of Swords is a tough cookie in her own right. You don't come to her unless you have the truth. Reversed, like I said, bitch on wheels. But you also, Queen of Wands, she's a tough cookie. She doesn't take nonsense from anybody. She's, uh, she can read the room and um, dismiss most of everybody. It's all about who deserves to be by me. Who will I allow to be by me? And there's not a lot that she allows that measures up to her. You will not be juggled. No one is going to juggle you. You'll be alone before you're juggled. So... You want loyalty. A Queen of Wands, of course, it's Leo energy. You're going to want loyalty, absolutely. You could have Leo in your chart very highly aspected. Let's get an outcome for you. What is the outcome for Cancer? So if somebody was out there playing around with you and you were in a higher level of commitment, which is the Ten of Cups, I don't know... It's done. I don't know what the outcome would be. You would like them back, I think. You care about them a great deal, but I just, I can't see a Queen of Wands taking somebody back. The world, it's over. It's over. The Hermit reversed. Turning your back ghosting, I guess. The devil, you're not going to sit and have obsessive thoughts about this person. They'll run through your mind, and yes, but you're coming out of the Nine of Swords. You're not going to let them take up your every thought. 
the Ten of Swords, you do feel that they have done the most to you, but this is reversed and you're not going to let yourself wallow in this. Painful? Absolutely. Did it bring you to your knees? We see that it did. We see that it did. But you're going to hold your head high and you know what you're worth. And you're not going to be played. Cancer, this is your reading. If it made sense, give me a thumbs up. Give me a like. Let me know that it's made sense to you. And if it didn't, come back next week. See me next week. Maybe we can dance then.